the story of uh, Rabia Basriya, uh, uh, Rahmatullah Aleyha. Uh, so around her time, there was a thief. So one, uh, so he came and he entered a house. Is an old woman. He said, "Let me go and rob this individual." And, and broke into her house. And as he broke into her house, and he starts to look around, there's not much. There's only a, a mat was John Maz, and there's some cups that she has or jug. And nothing else she has around, and and she and he sees a woman praying, and she's praying, and she she noticed of course that there's someone behind me, and, and she continued with her prayer and she finished her prayer, as she finishes her prayer he's about to escape out of her house. So at this moment, uh, she said, "Oh my son, where are you going? Don't go empty-handed since you came to my house. Don't go empty-handed since you came to my house." And he said, what is, there is, uh, what is there in the house that I'm going to go empty-handed? There's nothing here. What are you going to give me? And she said, come and stand. For, uh, uh, she, she tells him, stand in musalla, pray two rakat salah. That's all I have. And, he, and, and this thief and this, this person goes and starts praying two rakat salah. And she goes to the corner of her room. As he's performing salah, he performs one salah. And she's, she's making dua, oh Allah, my job was to put him onto the musalla, the rest is your job to accept. You know, so this is, uh, uh, the rest is your job to accept. As he finished two rakat salah, he gets up for the next two. Uh, he gets up for the next two, and he performs the next two. And he gets up for the next two, performs the next two. As he finishes, and uh, as he finishes and he's leaving, and she says, she says, oh my son, did you gain something? Did you gain something? You're not going empty-handed. He said, yes, I have, gotten, I have gotten everything. I'm not going empty-handed. So at this moment, she's standing and uh, she made dua for this individual and Allah had accepted him, just performing two a few rakat. And she makes dua, oh Allah, that this individual came to you for, and he only performed few rakat for you for a few minutes and you have accepted him. And you have made him your friend. He said, myself have been praying for 40 years. When will you accept me? And a voice came from, un, uh, a, a voice came to her mind. And uh, some voice came to her. He said, oh Rabia, you're, you're been accepted also. You're been accepted also. What is a lesson to learn from this story? It said this, in, this individual was not in, in the Western world. He was not in. Uh, he was in the places where the Muslims were there. She was from. She was from the time of Tabi'in and Taba Tabi'in, and the Adhan has been called 20, uh, 24 seven, five times a day. And but his heart is not being rectified and not purified by even listening to the Adhan, and he's in the act of uh, uh, committing these sins. But when he came into a proper sohbat, when he came into a proper household. Where she's the only thing she does is the worship of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, nothing else. And, and when he came into her custody and, he, and what he gained within few, a few minutes of proper uh, companionship, and this person changed into wali of Allah. And, and, and this, is, this is our state also. We have come for a few minutes, few hours, not even few days. And, and it is our dua that we take benefit from our mashayikh, from our, uh, our hazrat. Every moment that we get, oh Allah, do not keep us unaware of any of his blessings, any of his teachings that does not go, uh, does not go uh, uh, across our eyes or across our sides, that we attain from everything from it. And that is the same scenario that we are in, we're sinners, and we come in, and we're, we're, we're doing all this, and we should take all this benefit Come with open-minded, and, and and take as much you can from it, and this is this is what the story has uh, has uh, has taught us, and and then of course he had uh, just Rabia Basira is making to offer this this individual where she would have called the cops and kick uh, kick him out, but she, instead she's making dua and she's getting his acceptance and plus her acceptance, and that is that is the same uh, scenario for us that he's also making dua for us, but we have to be the one. That is uh, that they are approaching approaching him, and learning from him.